My name is Salim Khan. I'm the Vice President of Data Innovation at Dun & Bradstreet. My group is responsible for looking at brand new sources of content, whether they be social media or satellite data, to pull into our, our commercial database. The other part of what we do is look at new nascent technologies, things like advanced analytics and blockchain technology. Working with Synecron, we created a beta offering of our identity content from Dun & Bradstreet. So what we did was we took about 6,500 publicly traded U.S. companies and generated a new uh, piece of collateral, a blockchain identifier, which maps back to our Dun's number. The use cases are anywhere from payments and remittances, uh, cross-border trade, trade finance. What we're looking to do is uniquely identify counterparties that are transacting within this new blockchain ecosystem. And Synecron's been a great partner helping us develop our, our proof of concept offer. Uh, it's significant from multiple perspectives. In trade finance, for instance, there's a huge problem around misinvoicing, which literally affects trillions of dollars worth of trade and transactions. Uh, so we think that our identity content, which can properly invoice and properly uh, you know, create the, the names of the counterparties uh, within these transactions, will help kind of root out some of that sort of issue. You couple that with blockchain, where you have an immutable record of all the trade finance paper that's created, uh, you can root out a lot of that misinvoicing problem. Another problem is uh, the bust-out fraud or the double-spend fraud, uh, which is essentially one buyer, a malicious buyer, coming in and getting multiple lines of credit from multiple banks. The banks, unfortunately, are not talking to one another right now, but if you couple blockchain technology, which allows you to search across uh, an ecosystem of trade paper, uh, you can essentially root out a lot of the issues with double spend and, and the bust out fraud. So, long story short, what we're looking to do is we're looking to make sure Dun & Bradstreet's identity content is available, it's accessible in this new ecosystem. For Dun & Bradstreet, we are always looking to embrace modern channels of distribution. If you look at our history, we have done flat files in the past, we've done APIs, uh, we have product-based uh, content distribution. We see blockchain as being another distribution mechanism for our content. So we want to make sure we embrace this and go where our customers are headed, embrace existing customers as well as bring this to new customers as well.